Hello everybody, welcome to Impressive Image Maker's channel. This is Toshi Yagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer, I shot this image for a long time ago, analog age, 120 film reversal for fashion. Well, I have this image and also I made this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop used filter called Find Edges. And I'm gonna make some kind of illustration from these two images. Well, let's get started. Now I'm gonna make a duplicate layer this and uh, I'm gonna keep this base image. Then I'm gonna work on this copy of it. Now, I'm gonna smudge this image first then uh, let's see what kind of image is gonna be. Okay, using smudge tool, evolve. As always, these days, this is great. I'm gonna smudge over all and then after that I'm gonna paint on nice saturated color maybe and then let's see what's gonna happen Okay, almost done for smudge. Let's see. Background, foreground, all out of focus, so just get texture of the revolve brush texture. Now we're gonna see some uh, pencil drawing type image. Let's see, change the blend mode normal to darken. If I change to like overlay, let me see this overlay, soft light. This is kind of cool. Colors. Uh, pencil drawing type. This is subtract 15% go dark image. It's kind of, yeah, yeah, it has some kind of feeling. That's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. Well, why don't I? I may use a uh, dark line, so I'm gonna duplicate layer, then just keep this one for normal, well darken for one layer, then I'm gonna use this one, subtract 15% to get this dark image, huh? I'm gonna add layer, then well, well, that's interesting, okay. Now, uh, let me add around here. Well, dark, 100%. This is yellow now. More red. I'm gonna show this color. I, I'm gonna add another layer over this base image. Then use soft airbrush same thing then now just to density which is just gray okay change to this color layer brushes same thing Okay, go from dark blue first. Then again, I'm gonna add here the gray color. I think I can make gradation somehow. 
But no, that's okay. Just leave it there. Just try to make press some red on this color layer. I'm going to erase this later. Then yellow. Let's see now. I'm going to paint on here gray. Now there is uh, density on sky. So these colors show up. Hmm. That's interesting. Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna clear this. Then fill in light gray. Make gradation on gray rectangle. Not fill in. Select this area. Then feather. about this area now fill in because I just fill in here so it shows these colors now pass it down you see some colors too then I'm gonna clear this with the eraser tool on this layer soft airbrush Mm, that's the way you use it. Okay, now it's shape is the eraser. So that's why it shows these colors. Okay, now I'm gonna clear this again. Then again, I'm gonna add color on this from dark blue. Now let's see it shows. Oh, this way you can get some kind of cast, blue cast too, because it has here. Mm, that's interesting. I'm gonna mask, then take it out colors later. Now I'm gonna add some other different colors, like yellow. Then a little bit red, soft air brush, red. Okay, now I guess make mask on this layer. Yeah, make mask. I kind of like blue cast on here, but it's okay, just leave it some and this reflection here too. Yeah. Okay, now we have this mask. And also, I hope this copy this mask on. But that's okay. I'm gonna mask on this layer too. Make mask. No, same thing. You're brushing. Just hide these. No, using this mask. But this one, I'm gonna make gradation again. I don't need this. Uh, erase this shape, yeah. So I'm gonna clear this, then again, I'm gonna make on this layer rectangle. Now, feather, then color fill. Now, there you go. Okay, then this is mask. Uh, 
on this. Now I want to try just a touch more nice image. Okay. Now I want a more color one here. We have mask here, so I don't worry about that to paint here. Okay, now I'm gonna add some stars on this top layer and then let's see. Now, just hair brushing, soft brush. Then, now this time, inking and pen swine. Then, go here. This is stars. Okay, about this much. I guess we want some more dark blues, so I'm gonna add layer to put dark blue. Then make mask. Well, I guess that's it for that, about this mask. This may be too much, so I'm gonna tone down just a little bit. Okay, I want some more reddish color. Maybe I'm gonna add on here. Now we have dark image, I, let me explain to you so many layers. Okay, this is stars. Then this one is sky dark blue. Then this is pencil drawing type multiply. Then this one is dark and overall image around here this image. Now this is the sky and sunset color. Then this one is density of the sky especially. Then this is smudge damage. Now. Well, yeah, I want some more reddish horizons, so I'm gonna... Well, let's see on this sky blue image. If I can put red here. Okay, now we just add red. Oh, there is a mask here. So I can just soft brush. That's good. Alright then. I'm gonna add just a touch more. Okay. Now with just a touch I wanna lighten up their face. Just a touch. This is here. So duplicate layer. Then just looking at their face curves. Now again go up. Then red, yes, reddish, yellow, less bluer on here. Gamma goes a little bit down here, contrast. Okay, now make mask. Well, let's see. This is too contrasty, right? Okay, invert mask. Just reveal. Just touch, maybe a little bit highlight side goes sunset color. Okay, let's see. Okay, now overall done. Now last thing, I want to make some mask or something. Well, maybe make that frame, huh? Okay, I'm gonna make. Another layer for free. Okay, I think that's it. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, thank you for watching my video and uh, I think this is it for today. And 
I hope this movie is gonna give you some kind of idea for your creative work and uh, I really appreciate for you guys support and you guys have a nice day and see you next time bye now ciao